Yo, what's up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Jealousy 4 here bringing us more Madden 15 Ultimate Team, and also welcome to game number six of season five. And also, before we get into more gameplay details, guys, and information of this gameplay, I would like to say this real quick. I'm a little bit sick right now, so please bear with me. I'm sorry if I breathe too hard because you know I'm a little bit sick, so please be patient with me. I I really want you guys to to enjoy the gameplay. So, anyways. Um, this gameplay guys, you guys can already tell who is the key player, which is going to be Bo Jackson. It's already like right there in the title. It's all about Bo Jackson in this gameplay. That's all I'm going to say. And also, he did a range between uh, 50 plus yards and 300. That's all I'm going to say because if I, if I were to say the actual number, I think it's going to be a major spoiler. I think he did more or less. I'm not sure. Well, I'm going to say it's a range between 50 and, and 300 yards rushing. That's all I'm going to say. So keep a lookout on Bo Jackson. He did a hell of a job. So I uh, ended up back in offense, guys. So I ended up passing the ball right in the second play on the third, third and twelve actually, and I threw a pick. Yes, I know, guys. I've been forcing passes through all this whole season. I don't know what the hell's wrong with me, but I gotta get that passing attack fixed. Um, I don't know. Maybe call in different plays compared to the ones that I've been calling forever. So I don't know. I, I just gotta investigate more on my on my playbook. So I ended up on defense. Rasheed Mathis ended up intercepting the ball. Nice job by him because he's the uh, replacement for uh, Brandon Browner. So, he, it's like his second interception, I believe. He did one last game. Ended up back in offense. Bo Jackson take it, takes it all the way for a touchdown like for 70 plus yards. 70 plus yards. He already did 10 in his first drive. So, right there and then, he already has 100 plus yards. He did a hell of a job taking it all the way. I'm, I'm telling you guys, this guy has speed. Amazing speed, by the way. So, imagine if I have Jamal Charles. Except Jamal Charles, the only thing Jamal Charles uh, doesn't have against Bo Jackson is trucking, and that's it. The speed, agility, and all the acceleration, he has the same thing as Bo Jackson. So my main objective right now is to get Jamal Charles. If you want to keep running like you've been running with Bo Jackson, I got to get J uh, Jamal Charles. That's my goal, guys. I got to get Jamal Charles out here because he, if Bo Jackson can do all this, so can Jamal Charles, except he's going to be... Uh, taking the hits more more harder than Bo Jackson though. Bo Jackson can actually resist. Hmm. I got to sign in heavy running back too, so I'll, I'll be thinking about the Marco Murray and some other running backs also. So, anyways, um, back in offense, Bo Jackson trying to get some yards, like five yards, ten yards all the time. And I apologize right here, my HCPVR is kind of acting up, and I uh, didn't record this part really clearly. Uh, don't worry, guys. It'll go away. Like after this drive, I don't know what the hell's wrong with my HCPVR lately, but it doesn't want to record. So. Yeah, I've been having trouble with my recording equipment lately, a lot especially. So Bo Jackson ends up doing his second touchdown of the, of the game, 14-7, ends up back in defense. This guy does a nice, nice curl route right there with Jordy Nelson. And by the way, there was this one play where he burned with Jordy Nelson. He burned Antonio Cromartie. I'm like, what the fuck? You know, that guy's my fastest corner out there, and yet he gets burned. So it, it isn't like a like a problem right there man I gotta look at my cornerbacks and by the way Morgan Burnett our strong safety forces a fumble from that receiver it was just insane I was like god damn I didn't expect that from you man damn that's his first fumble like in a while good job Morgan Burnett <laughs> so um, yeah I mean I, I still think he's a good signing but I want somebody else I really want more out there so I ended up on offense and I ended up doing curl on the left side and I throw a pick. I don't know why I'm forcing so many passes, guys. I seriously need to step up my passing game because I'm forcing it too much. I think I really am. Ended up back on defense on the final play of the of the quarter, second quarter. Ended up intercepting the ball that right there nice with Rasheed Mathis. That's the second interception of the game. Uh, back on the kickoff and he ends up receiving. Nice curl right there. I think he should have been picked by Lance Briggs. I think he really should. But whatever, you know, whatever the game puts to the side of him not jumping for the ball, whatever, you know, I don't really mind. I can still stop him. 14 to 7, 2 minutes and 30 seconds to go. Lobs it down the middle, sends everybody in streak and nothing. 4th and 21, denied. End up back in offense, 14 to 7, just trying to run down the clock so I can go to the 4th quarter. Bo Jackson with a nice misdirection, takes it all the way for 50 plus yards. Touchdown with a little matrix glitch right there. Touchdown by Bo Jackson. Bo Jackson is all about that offense. He is just fitting perfect for my scheme, man. I really gotta get Jamal Charles, man. I really, I just really do. I, I just have a passion for Jamal Charles right now. Since, uh, you know, Bo Jackson really proved with that kind of speed, you know, I'm like, yeah, gotta get Jamal Charles. So that's it, guys. My opponent ended up quitting. 
after he threw like two Hail Marys. I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Just calling your passing plays, man. He did a hell of a job with, with uh, allowing it to, to uh, Jordy Nelson. I don't know what you're doing calling in Hail Marys. Sometimes opponents can get dumb, that dumb sometimes. When I'm losing, I always get smart. I always score them at my last minutes. I don't know. It's something clutch that I have. So that's it, guys. If you guys want to see more Madden 15 Ultimate Team, make sure you subscribe for more. And also, if you guys like the series, make sure you leave a like on the video so you guys can show some support for the series and let me know also that you guys want to see more of this. So, yeah, I'm currently 4-2. Uh, and two. I believe I still need to win two more in order for me to go to the playoffs. So, uh, yeah, I'll be reporting that on the next game. So that's it, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what's up, and I'll see you guys later. Subscribe for more.